What's up, what's going on legends? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're diving into Modern Warfare Zombies, and today I'm bringing you guys a quick mission guide for the Act 2 Tier 5 mission known as Mind Control. Now, this one is going to be two parts, and it does require a specific ammo mod. So if you guys don't have access to the specific schematic that you need for this ammo mod, then you guys will need to infill. You'll probably want to hit up Aether Nests, the Infested Strongholds, regular Strongholds, just kind of loot around the map, opening as many caches as you guys can, increasing your odds that one of the caches that you will finally open will have the ammo mod that you need. But once you guys are able to get access to it, you guys will be able to start this mission. Now, part one, asking us to turn 20 zombies with the brain rot ammo mod so the ammo mod you guys are going to need of course is going to be the brain rot and if you guys are confused at any point what this one is it is the one that has like the skull and crossbones on it you guys should be able to get access to it pretty easy once you guys actually have this you're going to equip it to the weapon of your choice doesn't really matter which weapon you choose then the only thing you're going to need to do is eliminate zombies eventually one of the zombies that you shoot will turn into a friendly zombie aka being turned now very similar to other ammo mod missions you guys could choose to put this on an underpowered weapon go maybe even into the tier two zone finding some overpowered zombies zombies, choosing to then use this on the overpowered zombies, getting a higher turning radius on the zombies that you need. Honestly, for this mission, I don't even know if it's more efficient to go into a higher tier zone or that it matters at all, as you are really just relying on the RNG of the zombie turning, and usually you guys are able to turn them before eliminating them, so eliminating them overall might not even be an issue. If you guys are having issues getting a ton of zombies, that way you're able to farm them quickly, you guys can go and grab an escort contract, typically you'll get a lot of zombies that way, or you guys can even do some spore contracts or even the outlast, which is the one with the satellite on it, no matter which contract you choose you guys should get a significant amount of zombies to be able to eliminate once you guys are able to shoot enough of them to turn 20 zombies with the brain rot ammo mod part one is then complete now part two is asking us to allow 25 zombies to be killed by the turn zombies now this is actually pretty easy as long as you are allowing the zombies to get the eliminations but anytime you guys actually turn one of the zombies with the brain rot ammo mod i definitely recommend at that point to allow that zombie to do as much of the eliminations as possible so even if it takes you just running around allowing that zombie to kind of chase you eliminating the zombies that are also chasing you that will also give you guys a better turnaround for your turned zombies getting the eliminations. If you guys do choose to turn a zombie, but then you're just standing there shooting all the zombies around it, it's more than likely it's going to have a hard time getting the eliminations that you need, and you'll probably end up turning way more than the 20 zombies required. So again, I definitely recommend anytime you do turn a zombie successfully, just allow that zombie to get as many eliminations as it can before it disappears. That way you guys will likely get the 25 zombie eliminations that you need with the brain rot zombie, even knocking out part two before you complete part one. Once you guys are actually able to allow the zombies to get 25 eliminations while they're brain rotted you guys will knock out part two and complete this mission that's gonna wrap things up for today's quick mission guide thank you guys for all the support in today's video all support in the channel i look forward to seeing y'all in the next one peace